Coming your way. Car number six, Corey Stein. Highest point scorer tonight. Outside of him is Nathan Pollage. Car 52 back on the inside of the second row is Cameron Birch. Outside is uh, Callum Beeling. Look for a green one as they're up the main straightaway, off and running. Very good and even start at the front of the field and Corey Stein is the one down low as they go around Pagel's corner for the first of 20 times. Cameron Birch tucks in there in position number two. Can we get around the super coat hairpin for the first time? Yes, we can. One lap down on the journey as they head around Pagel's corner one more time and down the back chute goes Corey Stein. Leads them into the super coat hairpin corner one more time. Corey Stein to the better of Cameron Birch. Back behind him would be Nathan Pollich. Trying to get involved in this little scrap is Callum Beeling, as also Michael Miller into the hairpin one more time. And it's still Josh Hearn would be the next car, but a, uh, a bit of a gap starting to appear at the front of the field as Corey Stein leads them around Pagel's corner. Bit of a battle royal for position number two as uh, Nathan Pollich tucks the nose in underneath and goes into position number two. Uh, the better of him would be the 29 car of Josh Hearn, then Callum Beeling as they head up the straightaway back to Gavin Thomas and the 37 of Kurt Grambauer. The lead two cars starting to put some distance between themselves and the rest of the pack and that's Corey Stein. Corey Stein up the main straightaway still to the better of Nathan Pollich back behind them to Cameron Birch. Cameron Birch coming under some pressure from Michael Miller. Miller right on the hammer back behind him would be that of Josh Hearn. Those three arguing about position number three. A bit of a gap back goes to Callum Beeling. And the next one through there would be Gavin Thomas. Back behind him is Kurt Grambauer, our race leader, through the Supercoat hairpin corner. And it's still Corey Stein. Corey Stein says, let's go for the final couple of laps. Corey Stein, Nathan Pollich going around Pagel's corner. Corey Stein's Nathan Pollich tucked right on the hammer too is Cameron Birch and back in behind them is Michael Miller. That's the way they go around the Supercoat hairpin one more time. The 29 car on the outside is Josh Hearn. Speed still a cracker from the mod lights around Pagel's corner and Corey Stein opened up a little bit of a lead as he goes through the hairpin this time and up the uh, zinc main straight away and under the tower. So Corey Stein, Nathan Pollich still in two. Back behind them still battling hard is Cameron Birch because he's got Michael Miller right on his hammer and the one on the outside is Josh Hearn. Back behind them is Gavin Thomas, so they're lining up. One behind the other for position number three. Tyson Snow is in there as well. Corey Stein opened up a very big lead now. Back to Nathan Pollich. Battle Royal is for position number three as they go around Supercoat hairpin corner. One right on the outside is the 29 car of Josh Hearn. He can't do anything about it. Gavin Thomas tucked in behind there as they go around Pagel's corner one more time. Corey Stein goes through the Supercoat hairpin one more. Under the tower, four laps remaining. Back to Nathan Pollich. The 52 of Cameron Birch is still there as they've got another lap on Adrian Renke as they go through the uh, super coat hairpin one more time. Corey Stein under the tower, two laps remaining. Back to Nathan Pollich. The battle is still on for position number three and at the moment Cameron Birch holds on there around Pagel's corner and down the back straight away. Josh Hearn still trying the outside, the white flag out. Corey Stein, one to go. Nathan Pollich, push and shove for position number three. We've got him three wide in the top corner. Corey Stein, home and hose, you would think. Nathan Pollich in for two. The one very high on the racetrack is still Josh Hearn.
Can he pull off some miracle at the end? Yes, he can. He gets home for position number three. Corey Stein, Nathan Pollich, and high on the racetrack, Josh Hearn. Oh, what a race. Come on, Gibby, make some noise. He didn't only win a feature tonight, he's probably crowned the new Campbell's Truck and Bobcat Series champion. Make some noise for the Q6 of Corey Stein. Gibby, one more time, make some noise for your new Series champion, Corey Stein. Paul, the mod lights have been fantastic tonight. I'm going to let Corey get the helmet and the gear off. We're going to jump over here and have a chat with Josh Hearn. He just snuck...